Let's take a look at the role of the lungs in the immune system. First of all, the respiratory tract is lined with a sticky mucous membrane. Cilia move the sticky mucus along with the pathogens and dust. There are also white blood cells, macrophages and dendritic cells, and antimicrobial peptides secreted by the respiratory tract. This is another look at how the cilia move the mucus in the respiratory tract. Let's look in more detail at the antimicrobial peptides. These are short chains of amino acid monomers. If you see here are two monomers and they're going to be joined together by a so-called condensation reaction, one of the products being water. The bond between the nitrogen and the carbon is known as a peptide bond. There are two main ways that these peptides can kill microbes. The first way is by transmembrane pore forming and here the peptides form holes in the cell membrane. For the second method, the peptides penetrate the cell membrane and bind intercellular molecules, disrupting the metabolism of the microbe. Now have a go at the quiz on this section.